The ARC has established centres of excellence to create scale and focus in designated priority areas. Through highly innovative research that addresses challenging and significant problems, these centres will build national research capability and produce outcomes of economic, social and cultural benefit to Australia. One such centre of excellence is the Centre for Ultra High Bandwidth Devices for Optical Systems or QDOS launched on the 9th of April 2003. The aim of the centre is to conduct leading edge research working towards the goal of the miniaturisation of optical components towards the photonic chip. To develop photonic chips, researchers will be working with new optical materials that have only recently been discovered, displaying unprecedented optical phenomena. The logo of QDOS is one such miniaturised optical component. The super prism is a photonic crystal structure with a remarkable property of being able to separate closely spaced wavelengths after only a few millionths of a metre. The executive team of QDOS brings a wealth of experience in senior research management, optical networks and intellectual property. The team is led by Ben Eggleton with Chris Walsh as the Chief Operating Officer. Yuri Kivshar is the Deputy Director and Martin de Stauke an Associate Director. Mingu is the Victorian Node Coordinator. Like any network, the internet has its limits and we're rapidly approaching the operational capacity of the internet as we know it. These guys are working to avoid a worldwide crunch. They're part of a multi-institutional centre of excellence called KUDOS. We really are heading headlong into a crunch, an energy crunch, in terms of the amount of energy that these, these, these routers consume. So not only must the internet get faster, it has to do it by using less energy. It seems like an impossible request. This looks like the answer. It's a photonic chip, a router that works not with electricity and electrons, but with photons of light. This is the future of the internet. It's the future of optical physics and photonics in general. This technology is going to change the world in a number of ways. Ultra high speed broadband is just the beginning for the photonic chip. The outstanding success of the KUDOS program over 2003 to 2010 gave the team the motivation and commitment to develop and present to the ARC a new proposal for an exciting seven-year research program in photonic integrated circuits, which the ARC agreed to support. So we're talking about a completely revolutionary photonic integration platform. There's some really exciting science that we're going to do of the most exciting areas of modern physics. Uh, metamaterials that offer unprecedented optical properties, nanoplasmonics allowing us to control light on the sub-wavelength scale, and hybrid integration that allows us to control light in three dimensions. And it's these uh, uh, new scientific programs that will underpin this uh, revolutionary photonic integration platform.
In 2017, Kudos leads Australian expertise in photonics, a technology of fundamental importance in communications, defence, consumer products and other sectors. Many of the benefits to be realised through the investment in Kudos will be realised years if not decades after the centre's operations have ceased. The outputs, the IP, the publications in ultra-high bandwidth signal processing will have significant impact on the quality of the national electronic warfare defensive capabilities and the sensitivity of our radar systems. The startup companies will play an important role in the development of low-cost, internet-enabled sensors for the environment and for applications and personal health. The training and education of a cohort of more than 130 expert researchers who have gone into industry, academia, government and professional roles and whose research expertise and problem-solving capabilities will provide ongoing benefits to Australia for decades. The legacy lives on.